The Li dynasty Li, Vietnamese, a circumflex Li Vietnamese, Na Li, Han Nam, Jia Li sometimes known as the later Li dynasty, was a Vietnamese dynasty that began in 1009 when Emperor Li Tai Tu overthrew the early Li dynasty and ended in 1225, when the Empress Li Chu Hoang then eight years old was forced to abdicate the throne in favor of her husband, Tran Gun. During Emperor Li Tan Tong's reign, the official name of Vietnam became Dai Viet. Domestically, while the Li emperors were devout to Buddhism, the influence of Confucianism from China was on the rise, with the opening of the first university in Vietnam in 1070 for selection of civil servants who are not from noble families. The first imperial examination was run in 1075 and Le Van Tin became the first Trang Nguyen of Vietnam. Politically, they created a system of administration based on the rule of law rather than on autocratic principles. The fact that they chose the Dai La Citadel as the capital later renamed Thang Long and subsequently Hanoi showed that they held on to power due to economic strength and were liked by their subjects rather than by military means like prior dynasties. Some of the noble scholars such as Le Van Tin, Bui Quoc Kai, Don Tu Tu, Don Van Kam, Li Dao Tan, Tahin Tan made vast contributions culturally and politically, allowing the dynasty to flourish for 216 years. Topic. Style of emperor-proclaimer According to Dai Viet Su Kentucky Tone II, in the seventh year of Thien Tan era 1034, Emperor Li Tai Tong generated the order to everyone to call himself as True Din, Chao Ting meaning, Royal Court which is similar to Your Majesty. Until the rule of Emperor Li Tan Tong, it converted to the title of Van Thang, Wan Shang the name derived from Mencius. Yi Tian Wan Shang. Finally, Emperor Li Sao Tong required all Mandarin to call him as Fat Fu Buddha. Topic History. Topic Background. In 1009, the early Le dynasty passed from flourish and downfall in 29 years with three emperors Le Dai Han, Le Trung Tong and Le Hua Tru. The last emperor Le Hua Tru died in 1009 after evil and brutal ruling in Dai Co Viet which made him and his dynasty becoming unpopular to civilians. According to some history records of Vietnam like Com Din Viet Su Thong Giam Quang Muk, Viet Su Luoc, Dai Viet Su Kentucky Tone Tu all proved that in October 1009, Le Long Din died because of consequence of his licentious life. The crown prince of Le Long Din was still very young and he could not take the power from his dad. Then, the conference by the members of royal court was held to discuss about the fate of nation. Finally, Li Kong Yuan, the high position Mandarin and aristocrat, was chosen by Dao Kam Mok and Van Han Buddhist monk to become the new emperor of Dai Co Viet. Topic. Founding The founder of the Li, Li Tai Tu Li Kong Yuan Li Gong Yun has been said to have had origins from Fujian province somewhere in his paternal bloodline, while little is known about his maternal side except for the fact that his mother was a woman named Pham Ti. Very few direct details about his parents are known, however, the ethnic Chinese background of Li Kong Yuan, at least on his paternal side, was accepted by Vietnamese historian Tran Quoc Vong. The Li dynasty was started by Li Kong Yuan, a former temple orphan who had risen to commander of the palace guard, succeeded Le Long Din of the early Le dynasty in 1009, thereby founding the Li dynasty. He took the reign name Li Tai Tu. The early Li emperors established a prosperous state with a stable monarchy at the head of a centralized administration. The name of the country was changed to Dai Viet in 1054 by Emperor Li Tan Tong. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Moving the capital. After a year of enthronement, in 1010 Li Tai Tu started to move the capital from Hua Lu Ninh Binh to Dai La Hanoi and renamed it to Thang Long. He wrote the edict on the transfer of the capital to announce his plan to move to the new place. This decision had marked major circumstance in Vietnam which opened the flourish era of the dynasty and followed by the other dynasties such as Tran, La, Mac that still used Thang Long as their capital in the long time as well as nowadays republic government. Topic. Throne crisis 
In 1028, Li Taita died at the age 55 with posthumous name than Vu Hoangda, Shane Wu Huang Di buried at Tho Royal Tomb. In his funeral, most of his mandarins expected Crown Prince Li Fat Ma to take a throne however three of his brothers are Duke of Dong Qin Dong Qin Vong, Duke of Duk Tan, Duk Tan Vong, and Duke of Vu Duk, Vu Duk Vong rejected this decision, then ambushed royal palace by their own armies to steal the throne. Crown Prince Li Fat Ma discovered the danger, then ordered to close all the gates of palace and arranged guards for protection, however his eunuch Li Nan Nia advised him to fight with betrayer, thus, Li Fat Ma decided to let Li Nan Nia to lead the royal army to fight against his brothers, Li Nan Nia succeeded in his campaign and caught Vu Duk Vong, the two others escaped. After that, Li Fat Ma enthroned and take the temple name Li Tai Tong, to grant his mercy to all those who tried to oppose him, he pardoned his two brothers Dong Chin Vong and Duk Tan Vong. Flourish era From the reign of Li Tai Tu with the other emperors, Li dynasty began to focus on solving some major and minor situation. Plus strengthen internal rule, the economy was promoted to high progress, especially agriculture. The government introduced Hin Tu Ministry of Punishments as the first system of law and legislation of Vietnam after gain independence from China and opened the education system based on imperial examination of China. Plus strengthen territory reigning, the royal court tried to expand their influence to the remote areas by managing the marriage policy such as giving princesses to marry with the other local lords for closer relationships with royal family, to conciliate those who were not loyal MTO government, the emperor will order princes to eliminate the revolts. Plus protecting country from foreigners, resolve and reconcile some minor issues with Song Dynasty, China, fighting against the invasion of Nanjiao and Champa. One of the big event of Li dynasty is changing name of country from Dai Ko Viet da Ku Yu to Dai Viet da Yu in 1054 under reign of Li Tan Tong. During the Li dynasty, the Vietnamese began their long march to the south Nam Tien at the expense of the Chams. In 1069, Champa Kingdom gained more support from Song Dynasty, so Cham stopped paying tributary to Dai Viet so this made the Vietnamese government felt angry. As the result, the Emperor Li Tan Tong made the expedition against Champa Champa Dai Viet War 1069 and successfully captured the King of Champa Rudraverman III, then Rudraverman III have to sign a treaty with Li Tan Tong to cede the Quang Nam, Quang Tri and Quang Bin to Dai Viet which massively contributed to the expansion of Dai Viet territory, consequently, Champa had to restore the tributary system to Li Dynasty. Soon afterwards, Vietnamese peasants began moving into the untilled former Cham lands, turning them into rice fields and moving relentlessly southward, delta by delta, along the narrow coastal plain. The Li emperors supported the improvement of Vietnam's agricultural system by constructing and repairing dikes and canals and by allowing soldiers to return to their villages to work for six months of each year. As their territory and population expanded, the Li emperors looked to China as a model for organizing a strong, centrally administered state. In 1070 Li Tan Tong ordered to construct Royal Academy School to educate people. Minor officials were chosen by examination for the first time in 1075, and a civil service training institute and an imperial academy were set up in 1076. In 1089 a fixed hierarchy of state officials was established, with nine degrees of civil and military scholar officials. Examinations for public office were made compulsory, and literary competitions were held to determine the grades of officials. <laughs> Depression era Emperor Li Nan Tong was the longest reign ruler in the history of Vietnam. However he was childless so he had to choose some of kids of royal relatives as the successor and then Li Duong Hon, Li Yang Huan his nephew was chosen to be the crown prince. In 1128, Li Nan Tong died at aged 63. At that time, Li Duong Hon enthroned at 11 year olds and took temple name Li Than Tong. The incident of death of Li Nan Tong had marked the transition of crown succession from main line to cadet line and also ended the flourish era of Li dynasty. After the reign of Li Nan Tong, all of his successors were too young and under control by regent and this led to the power competition among the regent. In the early of Li Than Tong era, most of the member of government were good people who supported emperor to rule the stable Dai Viet. 
Those people include Chancellor Le Ba Nok, Li Bo Yu Vice Chancellor Duong An Ni, Yang Ying Er Li Kong Bin, Mao Du Du, Mo Yu Du and Li Sun. In Li dynasty, most of emperors had a favorite hobby of collecting the rare and precious treasures and this hobby become emerging when Emperor Li Than Tong grew up, then this causes the increase existing of corruption, people who flattered or gave the emperor the precious good, can get into the high rank position in the court. In 1138, Li Than Tong died at 23 year old after ruling in 10, years, before his death, Li Thien Lok, Li Tian Lu the first son and had been granted title Dauphin of Dai Viet. Nevertheless, three concubines Cam Tan, Thung Tan and Nyat Feng corrupted the eunuch Tu Van Thong, Shu Wen Tong to encourage emperor to change his mind. The emperor was persuaded and replaced Prince Li Thien Tu Emperor Li An Tong as crown prince when he was three year old. Topic. Regent After that, concubine Cam Tan became the Empress Dowager and she fell in love with Du An Vu du Ying Wu who was sibling of Empress Du, she had the high confidence on lover so she put him as the regent of Emperor Li An Tong. This situation caused some opposition of Mandarin and royal members, then followed by the coup of capturing Du An Vu. He was not killed but must live exile as the farmer who works for the state. The Empress Dowager tried to restore the position for An Vu and she succeeded to bring him back as the regent and the chancellor. Du An Vu wanted to revenge who took him down by controlling the young child emperor to pass the law against the people who got involved in the coup. The emperor unwillingly had to approve it and all people who were impeached, then executed or go exile. In 1158, Du An Vu died and Tahin Tan who was the relatives of wife of An Vu, later became the chancellor. Different from his brother-in-law, Tahin Tan was the loyal subject to the Li dynasty with skills and talents in organizing military. He helped army to invade Champa and Lan Zhang. In 1174, Dauphin Li Long Zong caused debauchery with concubine of emperor, so he was deposed and Emperor Li An Tong made Li Longkan as Dauphin. Tahin Tan still hold the regent and vice-chancellor because he was too young. In 1175, Emperor An Tong died at aged 40, reigned in 36 years. The young Dauphin had to enthrone with title Emperor Li Sao Tong and Li dynasty began deep in the decline. Topic. Decline Li Sao Tong became the emperor at three and his mom concubine Du became Chu Thien Kai Li Empress Dowager, her younger brother Du and Di became consort kin and Tahin Tan was still a regent and teacher to teach the emperor. However, Chu Lin Empress Dowager, mom of deposed Dauphin Li Long Zong who tried to take the throne back for his son but not successful because of Tahin Tan's determination. In middle of 1179, Chancellor Tahin Tan died when Emperor Cao Tong was only six and Duan Di replaced him as regent. In 1188, Duan Di died and Go Li Tin replaced his mission till death in 1190. Then, Dam Di Mong, Tan Yi Men younger brother of Empress Anton, became regent. Emperor Li Cao Tong was raised up in the luxury life and he allowed to make court position sale which led nation into crisis. The useless or rich people could be promote as the high rank officials so this increased the social unrest, corruption, poverty and thief. Finally, these cause a lot of revolts against royal court by local leaders. Quach Bok Rebellion The Emperor Li Sao Tong enjoyed the luxury life and exploit the property of civilians to build the palace and castle and the hatred of people was being cumulated and some revolts happened, typically Quach Bok Rebellion Chuhan, Guo Bo Ji Luan Quach Bok Kai Lon, that was the main reason of weakening the dynasty and the power was seized by the other houses. The governor Don Thuang Duan Shang of Hong Province now Hai Duang and Hai Fong Provinces began the revolt against the court. The emperor ordered generals Pham Bin Di, Fan Bing Yi Pham Du, Fan Yu Dam Di Mong and the others to lead army to suppress the revolt. Nevertheless, Don Thuang corrupted Pham Du to retreat his infantry and persuade emperor to retreat all soldiers successfully. Don Thuang got the victory. Pham Du then was nominated to train the military in Nagian but he started to recruit the thief and criminals to make the robbery everywhere. Cao Tong dispatched Pham Bin Di to catch Pham Du, the Du lost the battle and fled to Hong province. In 1209, the emperor summoned Du back to Thang Long but Du slandered Pham Bin and prove him innocent. 
However, Cao Tong trusted Du's accusation and ordered to capture Pham Bin Di and his son Pham Phu. After getting news of capture his lord, the general of Bin Di was Quach Bok Guo Bo who decided to fight into the royal palace to rescue his master. Emperor Cao Tong and Pham Du suddenly killed Bin Di and son and both fled to Vin Phu, Yen Bai. Quach Bok captured the royal palace and celebrate the funeral for his master, then made son of Emperor Cao Tong Li Tham to be the new emperor. Prince Li Hao Sam Li Ri Chan fled to Hai Ap with his mother Empress Antone, they met the leader of Tran clan, Tran Li Shane Li and scholar Pham Ngu both support Li Hao Sam as the emperor. Li Hao Sam then married to the daughter of Tran Li, Tran Ti Dung, Shane Shi Yang after that he nominated and grant promotion to the people of Tran clan. The Emperor Li Sao Tong thought Prince Sam wanted to be the emperor and against him. Therefore, then he fought against Sam but failing to reclaim the throne, after that, Tran Li led the army against Quach Bok at capital city and won. The rebellion was ended. Topic. Rise of Tran clan In winter 1216, concubine Thuan Trin was granted the title as Empress. People of Tran clan were nominated in some important position in the court. Tu Khan was chancellor, his brother Tran Thua as interior guard with title marquis, Feng Ta Chu and the first son of Tran Thua, Tran Lu as interior mandarin and the first son of chancellor Tran Hai as duke of Hin Dao. Hin Dao Vong, Xi'an Dao in 1217, Don Thuong surrendered to the court, pardoned and granted title of Hong Vong, ruler of Hong province. At this time, Emperor Li Hu Tong usually turned into like crazy man and calling himself as Heaven General Thien Tuong and Heliki to put the flag on Xinyan, holding sword and shield for dancing. Then, he drank and slept after tiring. The emperor does not care about ruling country so all of power and right were relied on Chancellor Tran Tu Khan and the main power of dynasty was gradually belonged to Tran clan. Most of Tran members have done so much achievement and they gained more belief from the emperor. Most of works just needed to be approved by Tran family, not via emperor anymore. In 1223, the Chancellor Tran Tu Khan died and Tran Thua replaced his position and was given more privilege from Emperor he can move freely into royal palace and does not to announce name when working at court. Topic. Abdication of Li Chu Hoang In 1224, the serious illness harmed the longevity of Emperor Hu Tong but he did not have son as heir. Most of Princess was sponsored by Tran Tu Du. He decided the second daughter Princess Chu Tan will be crowned Princess and Empress of Vietnam. Hu Tong abdicated and gave the throne to crowned Princess and become the first Empress of Vietnam Empress Li Chu Hoang at six year old. Tran Tu Du sponsored all of events and workflow in royal court. He brought nephew Tran Gun who was the second son of Tran Thua to become the confidant of young Empress. Both of them then had blossom closed relationship. In aim to overthrow the rule of Li dynasty, Tran Tu Du had arranged the marriage for two people in next year and Tran Thua later became the prince consort of Li dynasty. Tran Tu Du then forced Li Chu Hoang to gave the throne to Tran Gun some sources said the empress did it willingly. As the result, the large festival was held at Thienan Palace and Li Chu Hoang gave the crown to her husband. The rule of Li was transferred to Tran, then the former emperor Hu Tong was forced to commit suicide by Tran Tu Du at Chan Gao Pagoda, the Li dynasty was collapsed and Tran dynasty was officially established. Topic. Civil service system At the central level, under the king were the Tai positions, Tam Tai for the three literary mandarins Tai Su, Tai Bao and Tai Fu, and Tai I for the martial mandarin. Under the face were the Thu positions like Thu Su, Thu Bao, Thu Fu, and Thu I. Topic. Administration division In 1010, Li Tai Tu changed the 10 Dao subdivisions into 24 Lo. The Lo was possibly subdivided into Chao in mountainous areas or Fu in the lowlands. The Chao and Fu were further subdivided into Huyan and Jop, and under them Hong and Ap. Topic. Law 
During the Li dynasty, laws in Dai Viet were primarily based on royal proclamations, although a body of law composing of civil laws, criminal laws, litigation laws, and laws dealing with marriage existed. However, because the Li rulers were devout Buddhists, the punishments during this era were not very severe. Economy Agriculture The pillar of the Dai Viet economy in the Li era was agriculture. Technically, all farmland was in possession of the emperor. Each village allocated the farmland to households. Each household farmed their allocated land and paid annual tax, as well as provided mandatory labors and military services. To facilitate cultivation, the central court built irrigation facilities and river levees. Buffalo and ox slaughtering was strictly prohibited since these cattle provided indispensable draft force in farming. Handicraft Trade The Li dynasty encouraged trade with foreign countries, primarily with Song China, Java, and Siam. Trade between Dai Viet and Song China in the border areas flourished. Private and government traders frequently visited Chinese trading ports in present Guangxi to exchange spices, ivory and salt for silk. The Li dynasty founded the port of Van Don in modern Quang Ninh province, a major trading port in Southeast Asia for hundreds of years. On the other hand, the Li court, particularly under Emperor Tai Tong's reign, tried to promote the consumption of domestic products. For reasons unknown, Emperor Cao Tong forbade the trade of salt and metal, giving rise to unrest and rebellions against the central court, which later led to the collapse of the Li dynasty. <laughs> Monetary Education <laughs> 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 Topic Literature Topic Art Topic Architecture Topic Sculpture Topic Music Topic Military The dynasty continued to employ new bin yu nong, literally, servicemen billeted in farms, a system dated back to the Tang dynasty and Din dynasty. Soldiers stayed in duty only several months per year, the rest of the year they returned to their home in peacetime. However at home they were still required to train regularly with their captains and comrades, and during wartime they were not permitted to leave. Soldiers were not paid by the state but they were exempted from tax and duty. This system allowed for a large trained standing army while the state was not burdened with maintaining it. New Bin Yu Nong shares many common traits with Swedish allotment system. <laughs> <laughs> foreign relations In foreign relations with the Song dynasty during the Li dynasty, Vietnam acted as a vassal state, although at its zenith it had sent troops into Chinese territory to fight the Song during the Li Song War. In 1075, Wang Anshi, the prime minister, told the Song emperor that Dai Viet was being destroyed by Champa, with less than 10,000 soldiers surviving, hence it would be a good occasion to annex Dai Viet. The Song emperor mobilized troops and passed a decree to forbid all the provinces to trade with Dai Viet. Upon hearing the news, the Li ruler sent Li Thuong Kiet and Tun Dan with more than 100,000 troops to China to carry out a preemptive attack against the Song troops. In the ensuing 40-day battle near modern-day Nanning, the Dai Viet troops were victorious, capturing the generals of three Song armies. In 1076, the Songs formed an alliance with Champa and the Khmer Empire and sent troops to invade Dai Viet. Li Nan Tong again sent Li Thuong Kiet. Being one of the many great military strategists of Vietnam, Li Thuong Kiet had placed spikes under the New Way River before tricking the Song troops into the deadly trap, killing more than 1,000 Song soldiers and forcing the Song army to retreat. According to legend, during this time Li Thuong Kiet had also composed the famous poem Nam Quoc Sun Ha Rivers and Mountains of the South Nation, which asserted the sovereignty of Vietnam over its land. This poem is considered the first Vietnamese declaration of independence. 
Topic: Religion. The main religion in the Dai Viet during the Li dynasty was Buddhism. The first century of Li rule was marked by warfare with Song dynasty, China, and the two Indianized kingdoms to the south, the Khmer Empire and Champa. After these threats were dealt with successfully, the second century of Li rule was relatively peaceful, enabling the Li emperors to establish a Buddhist ruling tradition closely related to the other East Asian Buddhist kingdoms of that period. Buddhism became a kind of state religion as members of the royal family and the nobility made pilgrimages, supported the building of pagodas, sometimes even entered monastic life, and otherwise took an active part in Buddhist practices. Bonzas became a privileged landed class, exempt from taxes and military duty. At the same time, Buddhism, in an increasingly Vietnamized form associated with magic, spirits, and medicine, grew in popularity with the people. Temple of House Chronicle See also List of emperors of the Li dynasty References External links Coedes, George, 1966. The Making of Southeast Asia Illustrated, Reprint ed. University of California Press. ISBN 0520050614. Retrieved 7 August 2013.